Earlier this week, we caught up with Horsehead's Dylan Manwaring on his second year with Braves Rookie Ball. Tonight, it's round two of the fight for another Major League prospect from the Twin Tiers. Corning Zach Sullivan. Zach finished up his first summer with the Marlins Rookie Ball system after a standout career with the Corning Hawks. He was a stud up there. Sullivan was drafted in the 14th round of the MLB draft in June and put up a solid summer. He batted 280 with two home runs and 11 ribbies in just 93 at bats while playing primarily out in center field. But none of this could have happened without great instruction. It was a great experience just to uh, be able to go down there and get the coaching that I had and that kind of stuff down there. So it was a, it was a great experience and be able to meet the kids and the guys that I met down there. It was uh, all in our, it was a great season. Out of some football now, last year was tough for the Corning Hawks, just 3-5 in 2013. But now it's 2014, and maybe it was a dome that, you know, is riding the ship. The Hawks topped Watertown at the Carrier Dome in Syracuse last weekend, 26-6. So far, so good for these young Hawks. Tomorrow night, it's home opener time at Memorial Stadium versus the Black Knights of Windsor. The crowd going to be rocking, but there's no place like, not dome, but home. We're all looking forward to our game on Friday night being our home opener and we're hoping to you know start strong, um, get our offense clicking soon and have our defense dominate the game. Uh, going into this week we realized that we, we need to have a, a great week of practice to get ready for a very tough opponent in Windsor. All right, moving on. Tough news out of Odessa Montour tonight. The Indians football team had to forfeit their first official game at Moravia Saturday due to lack of healthy players. Odessa has less than the 16 required amount for a game due to injuries. Ironic here, OM has a forfeit win in their first week of the season over Trumansburg, who ended their year early due to the same reason. Odessa hoping to play in their homecoming game versus Notre Dame next Friday night. And we remember on 9-11 here today, one of the most iconic home runs in baseball history. Then met Mike Piazza gave everyone in New York reason to come together back in 2001. This blast by Piazza happened just 10 days after 9-11 attacks and was considered by many a moment of healing for New Yorkers and the nation. Thanks to the two-run shot in the eighth, the Mets beat the Braves 3-2.